Konnichiwa, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. Today we have a captivating topic to explore. We'll delve into the ancient practice of Harakiri, also known as Seppuku, and uncover some untold facts about this solemn ritual. Join me as we deepen our understanding of the Samurai Code of Honor. The Origins of Harakiri To truly understand Harakiri, we need to go back in time. Seppuku originated in feudal Japan during the Samurai era, where honor and integrity were paramount. When a samurai faced disgrace or a serious offense, this ritual suicide was seen as a way to restore honor not just to themselves but to their family and lord. The Role of a Kaishikunin Here's an intriguing fact. During Harakiri, a second person, known as a Kaishikunin, was present. This individual's role was to swiftly decapitate the samurai after they had performed the act of disembowelment. This practice aimed to minimize the samurai's suffering and maintain their dignity. The Emotional Stoicism One of the most fascinating aspects of Harakiri was the emotional stoicism displayed by those who underwent it. Samurais maintained a composed and unwavering demeanor throughout the entire ritual, regardless of the excruciating pain they endured. This stoicism was a testament to their commitment to honor and the code of Bushido. Reasons for Harakiri Harakiri or seppuku was undertaken for various reasons, not just limited to personal failures. Some samurai chose this path to avoid capture and battle, thereby preventing potential humiliation by enemies. Others used it as a form of protest against perceived injustices. It was a complex practice deeply intertwined with the fabric of Japanese society. The Legacy of Harakiri Today, Harakiri is a historical practice and no longer a part of modern Japanese culture. However, its legacy endures in various ways, including its influence on the values of honor and integrity in Japanese society. Understanding the historical context of Harakiri provides valuable insights into the roots of Japan's rich cultural heritage. And there you have it, the untold facts of Harakiri, shedding light on the Samurai Code of Honor. If you found this video informative and thought-provoking, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more content like this. Thanks for joining me today, and until next time, sayonara.